Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Some types of fibroids may contribute to the risk of miscarriage and removing them can improve the chances that women suffering from recurrent miscarriages will give birth to a live baby, according to research published in Human Reproduction. Here is some information about fibroids. They are benign non-cancerous masses or fibrous tissue and muscle that may grow in or around the uterus. An estimated 3 to 10 percent of women of childbearing age have fibroids. They have been associated with spontaneous miscarriage but their role in recurrent miscarriage is unclear. Researchers from the University of Sheffield used x-ray and ultrasound to examine the uteruses of more than 100 women with a history of recurrent miscarriage. One feature the investigators looked for in particular was the presence of fibroids and, if they were present, determined whether they were the type that distort the shape of the uterus. About 8% of the women were found to have fibroids. Among these women were 25 who had fibroids that distorted their uterus cavity and 54 that had non-distorting fibroids. The 25 women with the distorting fibroids underwent a minimally invasive procedure to have their fibroids removed, and subsequently none of them had another miscarriage during the second trimester of their pregnancy. Interestingly, the 54 women who did not have distorting fibroids and therefore did not have them removed also saw a drop in their second trimester miscarriage rate following referral to the Sheffield Clinic, which specializes in recurrent miscarriages, as did another 285 women with recurrent miscarriage and no fibroids at all. Today's research is one of the first to clearly link fibroids with miscarriage and the removal of fibroids with reducing the risk. It also shows, however, that treatment at a clinic specialized in miscarriage can also help reduce the risk of miscarriage. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.